It's me. I'm back. I'm back in the side of the That's right, boys. I just clocked in at around 700 decibels. And we're gonna hop back into this game. This game right here. Undertale sequel, possibly. I don't know. Maybe this place is an abandoned theme park. Wait, where are those rides then? Maybe they abandoned it because... Because you forgot my voice. Maybe they abandoned it because there weren't any. Oh, excuse me. Knock, knock. It's like a shop, but the door is locked and no one's inside. Oh, the shop. And this is the question mark home. It's locked. All right, what about you? This looks like a sword area. It's locked. And this one is an inn. And it's... It, it's not an inn right now. It's an out. Ooh, in front of you, a castle looms beneath an empty town. A black geyser emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. We're in Castle Town. Hello. A castle? A castle town? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? Sorry to break the news to you, I understand your I IQ collectively is under three. But this this ain't the castle where the the town the this ain't the, the supply closet that we're used to, my friend. In fact, welcome, heroes. <laughs> Who's there? This is not a hero. Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please, come forward, both of you. Okay. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness. Chris, Suze, there is a legend in this land. A legend that one day two ears of light will arrive and fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, Eros, listen to my tale. Sure thing, my friend. Very well then. Once upon a time, a legend was whispered among shadows. It was a legend of ho hope. It was a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light. It was a legend of dark. This is the legend of Deltarune. Roll credits. How many times can I make that joke on that channel? Every single time. For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance. Bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, then a terrible calamity would occur. I forgot what the guy is from Marvel. The sky will run black with terror. And the lamp will crack with fear. Then, her heart pounding, the earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with low hope, three heroes appear at world's edge. Oh, the world doesn't have an edge. A human, a monster, and a prince from the dark. Only they can seal the fountains and banish the angels' heaven. Only then will balance be restored. And the world saved from destruction Today, the Fount of Darkness, the geyser that gives this land form, stands tall at the center of the kingdom. Okay. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. And with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believed you two are the heroes of legend. That despite whatever enemies you may face, you two have the courage to save the world. I didn't choose cur- I- Hey, excuse me, Prince, I didn't choose courage. I chose... Voice, I think? Delta Warriors! Ta -da. Please, won't you accept your destiny? <laughs> Sounds lame as hell. Nah. What? 
Me? Some kind of hero or something? You've got the wrong person. But, Susie, without you, the world will. So what? If the world gets destroyed, it's none of my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. This, see, you, you misread the prophecy. These are your heroes. I am light and, sh and she, he, it is darkness. So obviously we're not going to work together. We're going to work against each other. And you're going to have to be the middle man. Anyway, Chris, if you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to find a way out of here. Susie, wait! Oh, what is that? You guys know what I'm thinking. This is a mix of Pyro Jack, of, of, what's the other guy from Shin Megami Tensei? Jack Frost and Mr. Sam's himself. Ho, ho, ho. The heroes are already running away. And they didn't even know I was here. My dad's gonna pick me son of the month. Who the hell are you? I'm the bad guy. You clowns want to seal our dark fountain, huh? And still picturing you guys as clowns. Save the world from eternal darkness, huh? Uh. Don't try to deny it. We both know that you'll go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you go there. And I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it. Step one, I thrash you. Step two, you lose. Huh, nice plan, kid. R really? Yeah, actually... Mind if we use it on you instead? Ooh, baby, we got ourselves a classic RPG-style fight. I... Look, I'm gonna be honest with you. I know nothing going into this. I don't know if it's under the same pretenses as Undertale set. But I'm not... If I am given the option not to fight... What have I done? We have a glow shard. No, we have to just talk to him. Well, obviously we're gonna warn him first. We gotta confuse him, we'll check. He's got an attack of seven and defense of one, not to call a spade a spade, but he's a spade. Now I'm old enough to ride a motorcycle, so he set his bike on fire. Don't touch him. Halt, clowns. This bike is fueled by victory. Oh, all right. Okay, then. Don't know how I got an axe, but like, that's cool. No. Warn him. You tell Lancer to watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. I love to get thrashed. Just kidding. That's you. No chance. Oh, there was a chance here. Lancer's motorcycle is actually just a bike that's on fire. Yeah, I know that. You tell Lancer you can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. He seems flattered. His attack power went down. Hmm. Oh, you make my feelies do wheelies. Since wheelies. What did he- is that what he said? Lancer's motorcycle- okay, yep. Um... So, let's keep complimenting him. Well, now let's keep warning him. We don't want him to die. Lancer laughs at the idea that he would need your help. Okay, sure. <laughs> I'm the bad guy. Ah, shoot. Wait, wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. Alright, you punkaroos. You had the luck of the draw this time, but next time, the losers will be you. Haha, <laughs> bye losers. I gotta get home before dinner. You won. You got zero experience and 33 these nuts. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am. Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Uh, alright. That is one cool looking character. Hello everyone, I'm Razzly. Ra Razzly? Real Sai? Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm certain we're going to become great friends, and... Best way to leave is east, right? Yes, that's where we'll... Got it. See you at school, Chris. Uh, I suppose it's just the two of us then. Dude, I'm down to work with you. 
as long as you don't fight anybody. Chris, I'm a prince, but I um, currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here um, my whole life for you two to arrive, so I'm really happy to meet you. I hope we can become good friends, Chris. Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. You can lead the way, Chris. Hey, Chris. I really think we should catch up with Susie. You can come back here after our adventure is over. And then I can bake you a yummy cake. Remember that. We're storing it, storing it, storing it. Alright, when the game is over, we come back here we get ourselves a, a nice cake. From Kanzi. What's his name? Rousey, the Lonely Prince is now your ally. The power of fluffy boys <laughs> shines within you. Dude, I love fluffy boys. It looks like a shop. The door is locked, and no one's inside. You got anything to say about this? No, okay. So, Southeast. You know, right now, I'm, I'm thinking about it, and I'm like, I don't really want to find Susie all that much. I think Susie is actually evil. Misunderstood, maybe, but also can be evil and misunderstood. Oh, Chris, it's the dummy mini. Dummy mini I made. Now seems like a great chance to prepare for the enemy. Would you like me to teach you how to fight? Yes. Okay, get ready, Chris. See that heart, Chris? That's your soul, the culmination of your being. Within, it holds your will, your compassion, and the fate of the world. If it gets hit, you and your friends will lose HP. If everyone's HP reaches zero, we'll lose the battle. So please, take care to avoid the enemy's attacks. Ready? Let's try dodging. No problem. I know we got hit a few times, but we just weren't in the right mind space. Great job, Chris. You're a natural. Anyhow, after the enemy attacks, it's our turn, Chris. First, I'll teach you how to fight. Though fighting is unnecessary in this world. That's all I needed to hear. There's no harm in a thorough lesson. You hug Rousey. <laughs> Chris! Uh, I don't think, uh... I don't think this is what you're supposed to be doing, but... Let's try fighting. Don't worry, I'll hug, I'll hug him. You hug the dummy. Huh, Chris, you'd rather hug it out than fight? You know what? That's fine. We don't need to fight. Okay, next let's try defending. Simply defend and the enemy's attack will hurt you less. Not only that, but you'll also rather TP. Watch the orange bar on the left. I'll explain it next. Oh, we can already spare it, but we'll, de we'll defend. Great job, Chris. Now that you've gathered TP, how about spending that TP on one of my spells? If you had, um, hit the enemy, you'd be tired by now. In that case, we use my pacify spell on it. It'll fall asleep, and then we'll win peacefully. Hmm. It looks like we can already spare it. Let's, you know what? Let's teach this guy. He wants to teach us how to fight in his world. We'll teach us how he fights, how we fight in our world. Ross, I spared dummy. Chris, wouldn't you rather learn about spells? Okay, no, you actually have to use spells. Let's pacify him. He is a little tired, I think. Rousey casts pacify. Chris, do you know what a spell is? Can humans not even ask people to use them? No, I, I use a spell. I mean, I, I use I use a spell, but whatever, it's fine. Spare him. Rousey spared dummy. Chris, what if you just give me a hand sign? We used the spell, my guy. You got no more TP. Just spare him. Uh, this is too difficult. Let's move to the next lesson, okay? <laughs> Remember when you hugged the enemy by acting on it? Because of that, its name turned yellow. Now by using the spare command, you can win. Spare him. Great job, Chris. That'd be the end in the real battle. I'm really happy I had the chance to teach you, Chris. You didn't teach me anything. I taught you how we're gonna roll in this world. Oh, that was fun. You're a wonderful student, Chris. And, uh, in case you ever need a refresher, I... Here, I wrote a manual for you and Susie. Press C to open the menu using your items. You got the manual. Let's give a quick read of the manual, see if there's anything cool in there. You tried to read the manual, but it was so dense it made your head spin. Well, let's not read the manual ever again, then. Ah, this looks like a very similar door! Oh my, the great door is open! No wonder Lancer was able to come through. Chris, once we pass through this door, our adventure will really begin. A journey foretold exactly by the prophecy. Chris, 
I believe your choices are important too. That's not what I was told before, but I believe you. This world is full of all kinds of people, Chris. In the end, how we treat them makes all the difference. So let's try our best to get on, get by without fighting. If we can manage to do that, I believe this tale may be a happy ending. Otherwise, I fear that you may not find the result favorable. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that too much to ask? I got it. Chris, I knew you were a hero the moment I saw you. Let's try our best, all right? I'm on it. You can you can assuredly get one thing from me, and that's that I'm gonna try my best every step of the way. Ooh, I like these. What kind of trees are these, Birch? With the door closed behind you, your adventure will truly begin. The power of the adventure slide shines within you. Field great door. Okay. Onwards and forwards, and let's spare every man that ever existed. The field of hopes and dreams. Enemies ahead. You're gonna die. Signed, Lancer. Now, is it random? No, get away from me. We ain't never run. That's for dang sure. We scared him. Run, Rudin, drew near. Okay, Rudin. Let's, uh, let's see what we got. And you can use absolutely nothing. Just focus on defending. He's got a s defense. Attack is six. Defense is here. This ambivalent diamond is any girl's best friend. And look at the animation for our guy defending down there in the bottom left. Long live the guy who pays us. Ooh, don't mind if I do. They're starting off a little diff, like not super difficult, but a lot more difficult than, than last time. Okay, Rudin. I'm gonna convince you to s just step away because we're not here to fight. We're the heroes. Uh, spare tired foe. It doesn't, he, he's not tired yet, so just focus more on defending. You told Rudin to quit fighting. It was utterly swayed. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Why are you still firing your bullets at me then, weirdo? Rudin thinks about elaborate stones. Alright, Rudin. Get out of here, buddy. Get out of here. Chris spared Rudin. He won. He got zero experience and 38 Ds. Easy money. Literally easy money. If you're reading this, I guess you're dead. Signed, Lancer. Hey, what's going on, Lancer? Hey, don't read this sign. It's work in progress. Signed, Lancer. <laughs> oh, if it isn't my two favorite people. Psych, you guys aren't even in my top five. Lancer, where's Susie? You mean the purple girl? <laughs> you fools, you're too late to stop me. What did you do? <laughs> it was so simple. She beat me up, so I ran away. That's, that's a bit anticlimactic. Oh, let me know in the comment section. Just kidding. I, I don't... You know, I'm sure there's some psychologists out there that can tell me what my choice is in the video games, but I'm going down. Just let that music sit for a moment. Boy, Toby Fox is in there. He's honed his craft. These types of trees don't contain an item that can heal you. Whatever you do, don't check the tree and use, use open these. Use your menu. Oh, absolutely, thank you. There are two objects hanging from the tree. Take one. You got the dark candy. And give me the light candy. You got the dark candy. There's nothing hanging low enough to take. Where we go higher? What do you have to say now? Okay, nothing, nothing different. I know it's a sign, and signs don't actually talk, but this game is a bit of a surrealism type of experience. Heals 40 HP, a red and black star that tastes like marshmallows. Okay. You have anything to say now? So are you just going to stand there? I thought you would at least run to the right. Why? This purple ghost over there. Hmm, thanks for the hint. Hey, if you hit that way, my troops will thrash you. Is that a threat? I prefer to think of it as an invitation. <laughs> a necklace of Rudin's block your path. A necklace? Oh, it's because they're diamonds. Alright, Rudin. 
You told Rudin to quit fighting. It was utterly swayed. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Sense. Easy peasy. I've done this song and dance. We spare them both at the same time. You told Rudin to quit fighting. It was utterly swayed. Face my diamond cutter! Whoa. What was... Was it, uh... That little, like, outline on the heart? Was that just saying, like, hey, be careful? Rudin just likes his boss, but doesn't care enough to quit. Don't worry, I got you, boys. We spared them, boys. You won. You got zero experience and 70 Ds. D dollars? Doomsday dollars? It's the pizza man! Mama Miba! I'm Top Chef! My latest cake worked me to exhaustion! So I took a little nap! But Mama Miba! A scary noise woke me up! A beast was hunched on the table, eating his cake like an animal! I spritzed it away with water, and it hissed and ran off! But my wonderful cake is... Aw, oh, Chris, that sounds like Susie. You must be going the right way. Let's try to keep her out of any more trouble. The remains of the cake are still smoldering. Take a piece. Yeah, I mean, obviously, give me a cake. Give me a broken cake. Key items. Mama Mia, Mama Mia, Bapsheba. You know that beast. Please don't come back. <laughs> what you gotta say to me? Oh, rude and happy. No, no fighting. Act. X flatter. You ordered Rousey to flatter all the enemies. Out of anyone, I'm glad we randomly encountered all of you. I'm just a normal person. Heart, heart, heart. Whoa! Oh, this just basically lowers the effective range that we can dodge. Hathi has a little secret. Oh, we can just spare them both. Easy money. Alright, keep giving me those D dollars. And keep giving me some free dollars. Yes, please. Was there another tree? I don't, I don't know if I... Yeah, there was, but it wasn't... It wasn't a dark candy tree. Ooh, we got ourselves a little mission. Check the clock. In order to solve this puzzle, you'll have to hurry. I think I did it. Seemed easy enough. I get it. It's the beginning of the game. Not, these, these aren't going to be the hardest puzzles of all time. Behold the maze of death. Prepare to get lost, clowns. How about we get saved? Oh, give me the chest. Feeling lost yet? You must be utterly helpless among this twist of turns. Twist and turns. Your sense of direction will save you now. It's some sort of enemy. Looks like they got clobbered. Oh boy. Okay, well. Don't go this way. Hey, wait. Where am I? Help. Somebody help. I'm lost. <laughs> Lancer is quite the character. You opened the treasure chest. Inside was a white ribbon. You put the white ribbon in your armors. That ribbon is armor, Chris. It increases defense. Why don't you try wearing it in the equipment menu? I think it'd look great on you. Don't talk to me. No, of course. I, I actually, that was very polite of you. Give me the white ribbon. It increases our cuteness in our defense. That'll be useful. Did you equip anything? No, no, no. Well, obviously to the right. Oh, wait, there are actually twists and turns. Whoa, wait a minute. Even if you're my enemy, I've got to warn you. A purple beast is roaming, clobbering anyone who dares block her way. Sob, we don't even like fighting. The king left us no choice. Oh, Chris, we need to stop Susie, quick. Thank you, weird bunny rain man man. Hey, don't look! This sign's private! Okay. What about this one? Oh, it's just this way. Signed Lancer. Alright, <laughs> thank you, Lancer. <laughs> oh, sometimes you survive the mate, somehow. But don't count your blessings before they hatch. Let's see how you fare against this team! Three half is blocked away. Boy! X flatter. We don't need experience. Just encountering your smile is reward enough. Halsey is the greatest character, Halsey for Smash. Now just dodge the easiest attack in existence. Hey, why aren't you guys thrash? You're totally outnumbered. 
You made a team purely of support enemies. Their bullet patterns aren't balanced at all. It's like a dinner made out of three glasses of milk. And that's, um, unusual somehow. Why don't we talk about this after the battle? Spare them. Oh, we can't spare all of them at the same time, but it's alright. We'll save the best for last. Whoa. Oh, he actually can hit me. I've been bamboozled. Wait, no, don't don't flatter him. Can we heal? I mean, we can heal, but... We don't need our boy getting low. Get low, get low, get low. Thank you very much. Great job, Chris. We earned zero experience and $84. Sweet. How much do I get? You lost, Lancer. You don't get any. Oh. Can I have some of yours? No, you're an evildoer. Fine, later, losers. I'll give you five bucks. Sup? I thought you were running away. Yeah, I finished. Oh, <laughs> you finished running. Oh, boy. I mean, we did it. We need... We need three people. We don't have enough people. Alright, we don't even need to do this. We'll come back to it. Uh, open up, you stupid door. Oh, great. It's you guys. Susie, we were ever so worried about you. Oh, you were. I, I wasn't too worried. Um, how'd you get past those spikes before? Walked through them. But this door sucks. Aw, oh, don't worry, Susie. It'll open after we solve the puzzle over there. Nice. Tell me when you finish it up. Uh, Susie, we need you to finish it. Sometimes, proceeding will take all three of us. Furthermore, only Chris can seal the dark fountain. So if you don't accompany us, you won't make it home. So you're saying I have to stick with you guys? Yep. Let's just get this over with. Yahoo! Susie's back on the team. Cue the fanfare. There is no fanfare. Susie is the worst character ever. Very reluctantly joining the party. Susie follows at a distance such that no one can tell she's associated. Fantastic. That's just what I like to see. Easy money. Sounded like a door open. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, artichokey. Chris! I realized that Susie missed the tutorial. Next battle, we should show her how to act. It's not gonna work. I think she might really enjoy that. Sea round. Sea round attacked violently. You recalled Railsy's advice to include Susie in an act. Ek compliment. And you can defend. You ordered Susie to flatter the enemy. What? Why the hell would I do that? It attacked us. Let's smash it before it moves. Aw, oh, look, Susie. It seems harmless. If you act nice, we might win without hurting it. Okay, okay. Hey, little guy. I really like that axe in your face. Susie! You killed him! Where'd you get it? <laughs> um, Chris, maybe I should talk to her. If this ruins my pacifist run, I'm gonna call up Mr. Fox. Okay, so next battle we'll have her talk to him. Hey, hey I sneaked by and made a sign. Signed, Lancer. Maybe if we leave and come back, he'll be back. No, okay. Alright, next time you're on the case, because she's not gonna listen to me. Um, Susie, I suppose you missed what I said earlier. As heroes, we have the power to make a peaceful future. So, from now on, let's try to avoid fighting, okay? Um, what if you just took it easy on him? If you weaken an enemy, I can use my pacify spell, which can put exhausted people to sleep. Yawn, yeah. You talking is already doing that. Well, um, just think about it. We might have to warn enemies about her, Chris. I'm on it. Susie, the Violet Tormentor is now your ally. Ally, the power of girls shine within you. Hello, bunny man. Hey, hey kid. You wanna buy a tutorial? It's only 50 dark dollars. Yeah, give me a tutorial. <laughs> really? You really buy it? 
<laughs> right this way, gent gentlers, gentlerners. What are these weird Care Bears? We're sorry, we're normally puzzle guys, but we've been forced to do tutorials just to make ends meet. When the king got power, he fired everyone and replaced all the puzzle makers with him. Luxus card. Lord of the puzzles. Be careful. I'm TP Master. Ask me about TPs. TP, what's a TP? It's what lets you cast spells, see? When you see that orange bar, cast some spells when it's filled up far. TP, it's quite a caper. TP stands for toilet paper. No, it stands for tension points. What? Really? You're not much of a TP master. You get TP when you defend, protect yourself, then cast spells, friend. You also get TP by getting close to bullets. Oh, that's what that thing was. Look for the heart outline when getting close to bullets. You run bullets with bullets. Because it's important. What about the secret? TP only lasts inside a fight. Once you win, it's out of sight. Having extra feels unbearable. No point in saving. It's straight up terrible. But leftover TP per turns into extra money at the end of- These are the type of tutorials I'm willing to pay for. You mean I only should have been using one square? I'm Rousey, Master. Ask me about Rousey's. What? What is a Rousey? Oh, that's her. Rousey spells called Massify. Use it on babies before they cry. What? It safely rem removes a tired enemy from combat. What if you're fighting a baby? Rousey loves when you give us money. He will hug you and call you honey. <laughs> hey, that's not true. You don't need money to get me to do that. Aw, oh, Rousey, you weirdo. Rousey has a spell that heals, dude. Can it heal the enemy? Why use that when you can eat food? Because you won't have to use up an item? I could have avoided all those empty calories. I'm Susie, Master. Ask me about Susie's. Warning, fact, and attack. When Chris uses warning, Susie can't hit. So make sure to... So there's no reason to use it. Uh, unless, unless you want it not to hurt. So there's no reason. Susie loves when you give us money. She will... Nope, don't care. Did I say something funny? Susie always attacks the foe on top. She'll smash him with a crushing chop. She always strikes at the first thing she sees. Oh no, oh no, she's looking at me. What about me? I'm Chris Master. Ask me about Chris's. Receiving. Reviving, I mean. When HP goes negative, your friends fall down. But bringing them back, it's easy, child. Plain foods and spells work like a charm, and with a mint, you can cure all harm. Even normal enemies or normal items and spells can revive people, huh? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, he's got three hats. He took the red guy's hat! It's a good idea to give us bucks. It'll make you happy and fill you with lux. Over there is our donation hole. We had a box, but it got stole. I'll, I'll donate a little bit. If you only act, you might start to think. What about the guy with the soap? Scarf and pink. If you know acting will make the enemy friendly, then you can ask me to spare on the same turn. Or cast pacify if you know they'll get tired. If you, if you plan ahead, a lot can happen in one turn. Hey, who's the master here? Me or you? So what I'm, what I'm getting here is that if it's truly us three working in a fight, it seems to be me who does the acting, middle girl that does the healing pacifying, basically becomes a master of pacifying, and Susie who just tries to soil all of our plans. Whole goals. One is monthly tutorial weekly. Ted is weekly tutorial monthly. 100 is stop making tutorials. Let's pay 100. The king didn't even give us severance pay. His son just gave us all beanies. Itchy beanies. Do we have $100? I feel like there's a chance. We do! Okay, let's pay $100! If you like tutorials, please throw your money into a hole. What? You put a dollar in the hole. The hole became full. The hole is filled to the brim with cash. You didn't... You guys didn't prepare? You guys didn't prepare to, to fill it with 100 What does that even mean? Month you get a monthly tutorial weekly, and you get a weekly tutorial monthly. It's very weird. Can we fill it up again? Alright, well, at least we tried to donate. Hehe, <laughs> welcome travelers. Dark Burger Amber Card. Or 
weapon, black and orange. We're not gonna ever need a weapon because we don't attack, my friend. Let's buy an amber card. Let's buy another amber card. Take your time. Ain't like it's better spent. Hold on. Uh, glow shard. I think glow shard is made, sell, like supposed to be sold. So let's buy another amber card. Don't have anything better to do. The name's Seat, pronounced Chomp. And this is my little shop. Ha <laughs> ha. Over the years, I've collected odds and ends. Of course, I've no attachment to any of it. It's just a hobby of mine. Around here, you learn ways to pass the time or go mad like everyone else. Long ago, the Darkners lived in harmony with the Lightners. They were like gods to us, our protectors, our creators, those who gave us purpose. Then, one day we were all locked away in this prison, and the Lightners never returned. Embittered, the king took up arms, and aimed to take revenge upon the Lightners that left us behind. Of course, even among his troops, some still distantly hope the Lightners will return. Historically, this land is ruled by four kings. A little Dark Souls reference. From Card Castle to the east, but recently a strange knight appeared, and three of the kings were locked away. The remaining king put him and his strange son into power. This land has not seen this much chaos since. Ha <laughs> ha Well, you don't need to know about that. Ha ha ha. So you are the heroes who are supposed to seal our fountain? Ha, <laughs> good luck. It makes no difference to me. Neither light nor dark hold a future for a dark man in my condition. Alright, great work. Thank you for talking. Let's equip my sons. With an amber card. A thin square charm that sticks to you, increasing defense. That sounds kind of gross, but it's fine. Amber card, amber card. Oh, oh, sorry there, bud. Did we not have enough armor for you? Beginner's axe formed from the mane of a dragon rope. Susie, the violent tormentor, is now your ally. The power of mean girls. Mean girls. All right, seventy-three thirty-seven. Perfect place to stop. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm digging it so far. I'm a little nervous. I, I think first off we might have not been able to continue the pacif pacifist run because I think she killed that red dude. Um, but that's I mean that's pretty much what we're going for. But in the end, we're going to complete the game. Like that that's my goals here. Regardless of how we do it, a game is meant to be played how you want to play it, and we're gonna try to aim for pacifist. But if it doesn't work out that way, I'm sorry. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to let me know or not. Thanks again. And expect more of this content soon. Goodbye. That's it.